Now, we are diving into some really good stuff, rudiments in six note groupings, starting with the double paradiddle. This is among the 40 rudiments, and the double paradiddle makes an awesome tongue groove, both in triplets and in 6-8, and it can be played as a great halftime shuffle as well. The pattern is... Right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, left. And it's very similar to the paradiddle, but the double paradiddle has two more single strokes than the paradiddle because it is in six. Double paradiddle. The first group that I want to show you is a slow 6-8 tongue groove. It's based on a song Father written by a friend of mine, Wendy. So I will now demonstrate the groove for you. And uh, you can practice along to this song on Spotify. I'm not the drummer in the recording. The drums are programmed. But this is how uh, I played it live. And it's a very, very good song to practice along to. Here for the demonstration, I'm going to play along to the famous arpeggiator uh, and set the tempo to the same tempo that the song is in the recording. I'm using the arpeggiator because of the rights so that I, I cannot use the song here but you can listen to it on Spotify Number two is the same groove in a faster tempo in triplets, like in the Eddie James song, The Name of Jesus Lifted High, only this is played with a double paradiddle pattern. The snare will be on the fourth stroke of the double paradiddle, unless you want to play it as a halftime groove. One, two, three, four... Number three is a halftime shuffle between the ride and the snare. You can of course orchestrate this between the ride and the hi-hat or between the hi-hat and the snare. You will also see how I played this double paradiddle pattern as a halftime shuffle in the song Hosanna to the King in the chorus. Hosanna to the Holy One, Hosanna to the King, the Son of David, Hosanna to the King, Hosanna to the Holy One, Hosanna to the King, blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord Pay attention to the importance of accents. The louder strokes on the backbeat and keep the ghost notes in between really low when you are using these rudiments as grooves and fills. You will find tons of videos on ghost notes online as well. I will also demonstrate this as three different fills in triplets and in 6-8. And number one is with an accent on the snare on every downbeat as three triplets. Let's try this in triplets, playing one bar of groove to give you a context. One, two, three, four.
And then let's play it in 6-8. Let's try and play along to the famous arpeggiator so that you can get a feeling on how it works. Number two is a tom fill in triplets starting on the snare with right left moving to the high tom, right left, and then to the mid tom, or in our case we will use the floor tom, right right, and back the same path starting with the left, left right, and left right ending on the snare with two lefts. And then we will try 6-8 along with the arpeggiator. For some more fun, try this double paradiddle down and up the toms and then four strokes on the double kick pedal with cymbals in the end, counting it as 16th notes. Or you can simply play the last four beats on the snare if you don't have a double kick. Number three is between the snare and the floor tom only. First I will demonstrate it as triplets and then as a 6-8 fill. One, two, three. Let's try it in 6-8 as well using the arpeggiator.
So this rudiment can be played in a triplet feel or as an eighth note feel like in 6-8, just as the grooves. A pretty awesome rudiment, eh? In addition, it can be played as 16th notes, which I will demonstrate with our next rudiment, the paradiddle diddle. Hosanna to the king, Hosanna to the holy one, Hosanna to the king. Blessed is he who comes 